These videos are intended as refresher training and pointers for our contractor and wholesaler partners. These short videos are not intended to replace a Navian training class. Please contact your local wholesaler or manufacturer's rep to schedule a training class for your company. If you are a service tech servicing a Navian unit, please contact Tech Support at 800-519-8794 and record your service visit by the serial number for that unit. Navian records all service on all units for future reference. If you're a homeowner, please do not attempt to service or adjust your Navian on your own, as service by untrained persons voids the Navian warranty. Please go to Navian.com and use a dealer locator on the website to look up a local service provider in your area. Hey, this is Brian with Harry Eckloff and Associates. And in today's video, we're going to show you the three basic ways to set up recirculation with the Navian NPEA. Basic operation for the Navian NPE is cold water in, hot water out. Next is internal recirculation. So in order to do that, we need to change the dip switch. The valve's ready to go. So to access the dip switch, flip up the cover. We have two banks, bank of 10, bank of two. In order to activate internal recirculation, simply turn on dip switch one on the bank of 10. The two-way valve is already set for internal recirculation from the factory. In internal recirculation, we're using our onboard pump with the heat exchanger and a one liter buffer tank to maintain a small mass of hot water to be delivered even with a trickle of demand, which also helps eliminate cold water sandwich in between draws. No other tankless water heater has the ability to do that. So for more information on cold water sandwich and lag time, check out the link to the video above. The second way to do recirculation within the NPEA is to use the NaviCirc thermostatic device, which is usually located in the farthest sink away from the water heater, which utilizes the cold water for a return line which reduces the amount of lag time and hot water delivery. In order to set up the Navian for use with the Navi Cirque, we simply need to turn on dip switch number two and change the position of the internal two-way valve for external recirculation. So in order to use the cold water line for the return line, you must pipe it in with a T going over to the recirc connection, as well as a check valve installed between the T and the cold water connection on the unit. Next is external recirculation. We're gonna use a dedicated line from the furthest point in the house to bring hot water back to the recirculation port of the unit. If piped in three quarter inch, it gives you the ability to go up to 500 feet of total equivalent length in your recirc loop. So if you need any further help, reach out to your local Navi distributor or manufacturer's representative. Thanks for watching today. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and check out any other videos on the channel that may interest you.